Welcome back, hunters, to another episode of Helix's Wild Hunts. Today, we're going to be trying a bit of a challenge. We're going to be going against the Pink Rathian Solo. I've already shown you guys the Azur Rathalos, and I thought it'd be about time that we tried to take on his counterpart. I have no idea what to expect. This is actually going to be my first time trying to fight her, so... Wish me luck, guys! <laughs> and now, the English patch is not set up at the moment just because there was some recent updates on the game, so we're just waiting for Team HD to update that information, and then that's why you're seeing this recording showing as not having that on. Alright, let's get hunting! Alright, so luckily I get to take advantage of the full blue box since I'm the only one fighting here. And I forgot to eat a meal, so... <laughs> That's probably not for the best, but uh, hopefully we do okay without one. And, uh, look who it is! It's our friend the Pink Rathian. <laughs> Compared to her counterpart, the Rathlos, she stays closer to the ground more so than he does, considering that he likes to fly around all over the map. Now, I should be getting the new graphics card next week on Tuesday, so I'm hoping that with that and the new PC that I'm building, that my performance on this game is going to be a lot better. Wow, I am doing terrible, and I... <laughs> it's a good thing I brought Antidote, because Rathian is known for poisoning. Ooh, almost, almost got flame barbecued there. Oh, she tried doing that again, too. Now this is an HR rank 5 hunt, and these are much... <laughs> wow, I forgot to reload. I am a noob. These are much more difficult than uh, the other HR hunts that I've been doing recently. Whoa, okay. And into the next zone I go. As you can see, she's over in the other zone there. I gotta say, I really love the attention to detail in this game. I mention it every single time that I do an episode, but the fact that you can see the monster in the distance is really neat. I'm gonna try to flashbang her, and apparently that was not in her line of sight. Uh, oh, got a block here. That's her staple spinning, swirly air, poisoning, barbed tail swipe that we love oh so dear that she does in all the other Monster Hunter games. Now, it's very difficult to get new gear in Monster Hunter Online, and hopefully as I keep progressing and hunting some of the HR5 hunts, maybe I'll start getting some better armor. Right now, this is doing me well. Uh, the Tigrex Gun Lance I'll be upgrading soon. Try to land my Women's Fire. Hopefully, get some more damage going on this battle. The Pink Rathian has a lot of lock on mechanics that make it very, very frustrating to try to dodge. Sometimes all you need is a little hop and you're good to dodge. Oh, crap! Oh, I did not expect her to do a secondary spin. And we only have seven antidotes left. So it looks here like they kept Conflagration Rathian's attack where she swipes the ground with her tail. Woo! A little too close for comfort. As you can see, I've been uh, kind of locking into her tail. I'm trying to sever that. Try to do as much damage as possible. So it looks like I have my alt ready. I'm saying alt now just because I've been playing a lot of Overwatch. <laughs> I'll wait for the right time to use it. For now, keep on inflicting as much damage as possible. Also, guys, thanks so much for correcting me. I think I mentioned that the purple slash was like a critical attack. Uh, someone corrected me saying that it's uh, negative affinity. Um, I'm not too sure. I haven't really followed some of those things, so I'm not too sure if uh, 
which is accurate. I know that they try to explain what that slash move is during the loading screens, but it's in Mandarin, so I don't understand what it actually is. If anyone does really know what, uh, I guess, that hit mark is... Oh! Oh, that was close. Uh, let me know in the comments below. Always appreciate getting corrected when I need it. Oh, whoa, that was close. Very, very close, but I managed to stun her. And I activated my awakening. Uh-oh. Ah, oh, she caught me in the wind gust. So right now we are entering almost the 10 minute mark of the fight. So far so good, I've gone through- Oh, I did not expect a follow-up to that. I was gonna say, so far we've only gone through five antidotes. It looks like I only have four left, so that's probably not too good. Hi, Pink Rathian. Now, what I can do is I brought with me- Oh, what? How did that hit me? <laughs> oh, those hitboxes. Sometimes they're a godsend in this game, and other times you're just asking what the hell just happened. Oh. And then for a spin attack. Oh, I forgot to reload. Now I did bring with me two traps. I'm gonna try to use Shock Trap, I believe this is the one. I keep forgetting which one's, yeah, it's a Shock Trap. And then I'm going to lure her in so I could use my alt attack and deal some massive crits. All the crits. <laughs> All right. Wham, bam, thank you, Pink Rathian Ma'am. I'm sorry, I... I thought it was funnier when I thought about saying that in my head, and it just came out stupid. Oh, crap. I am getting hammered by her. And I can't do anything here. Okay, I need to get this poison off ASAP. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, thank you. Finally, you did so- Okay! That- I thought- Wow. Alright, so that's one death on my part. I really thought that she was locked on to my feline, and uh, apparently that was not the case. Alright, let's get back to the fight! <laughs> Alright, we are almost at the 15 minute mark. Still haven't seen much indication that we've done enough damage to her. I can't see where she is. Ah! And we're uh, down to one antidote. That is, uh, that's uh, not good. I've already gone through all the blue box potions. I guess we're gonna rely on our potions and mega potions and joy. She's set the ground on fire, so now I gotta deal with that while I'm fighting her. Sometimes it's just better to block. Alright. I'm gonna go for just a regular Wyvern's Fire. I honestly thought I had the double charge ready there, but that was my bad. How did that not hit me? I am not in a good position here. I'm poisoned. I don't have... Oh, crap. That's not good. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Well, that's cart number two, guys. I got one more life in me, and then I'm out of there. Which, by the way, I am playing that way. I know that in this game you get those feline coupons or whatever to revive yourself. I'm not- I don't like doing that. If I die a third time, I die. It's not- that's the end of that match. I'm gonna use 
my other trap while I have the chance since I have my ult ready. Put down the pitfall. Oh, that was close. Too close, too close. Come on, Rathian. Come on! Bring it on. All these bugs better not even try anything. Oh, nice. Perfect. She. Wow, that bug almost got me there. It was trying to ult block me. And I'm gonna see if I can land my Wyvern's Fire quickly before these bugs paralyze me. Ah! <laughs> that was so satisfying to watch. Ooh. I love the sound of that fire in the background. Simmering. Scorching the earth. Oh, come on, bugs. Wow, they... They were not helping me, and then they did help me, in a way, from, I guess, their own stupidity. I freaking hate these bugs. Oh, crap. Okay, so I, I'm out of antidotes. We're running down the wire here. Oh, come on! <laughs> what the freak? Come on. And I still haven't managed to knock her out of the air. I feel like the monsters in Monster Hunter Online are way more resilient than they are in the regular series. Okay. Whew. I just needed an opening to heal there. That was kind of close. Too close for comfort. Oh, come on. Oh. I should not have been doing that. I should have been blocked. Whoa, 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 Okay. Getting out of there. Getting out of that corner. Wow, that was close. That was way, way, way too close. Almost botched the whole fight there. Alright, but I do got one more ult ready. Come on, any more flinches? And my woman's fire. Oh, she's in midair there. Yes! Alright, perfect. Got her to fall. Nice combo here. Use my ult. This should do a lot of damage to her. Oh my god. We're at the five minute mark. I don't even know how much health she has left. We haven't even severed her tail. Oh, nice. More flinches. I'll take all the flinches I can get. Still going after that tail. I don't care. Ooh, oh, I thought I, I thought I dodged it, but I guess not. My luck's not completely there. Oh yes! All right, tail is severed. running out of time. I'm getting very worried that we're not going to be able to defeat her. The flinches are always a good sign. Come on! Nice. I was able to land two Wyvern's Fire blasts on her consecutively. Perfect. Come on, come on. No, you're not going anywhere. She was getting ready to run away. I think, I think she's I think she's almost done. We're not capturing, no. No. We are going to destroy her. Yes! Oh my goodness, that was so close. Alright. Oh my goodness. That was the Pink Rathian, guys. I hope you enjoyed that fight. Wow, another one close to the wire. Alright, that wraps up another episode of Helix's Wild Hunts. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that fight. Next episode, I should have my new computer built by then, and also my new graphics card, so hopefully that will be helping us a lot with the game since it is very graphics intensive. And uh, prior to this, uh, my current computer and CPU is bottlenecking me hard. So uh, yeah, I'm very looking forward to that. And again, thank you guys so much for all the comments. I really appreciate that. 
If you have any other suggestions or anything you'd like to see now that we're getting into the HR5 hunts, please let me know. I wish you all happy hunting, and I'll see you all on the next level.